Hey, brother. Ben, you know I'm so excited right now. I found out they're coming out with a new movie today. A movie I think that you are just going to hate. Can you guess what it is? Can you guess what it is? Finding Dory. Ah! But another great news, Ben, I'm healed! Or at least I finished physical therapy. Really, it wasn't that bad, and honestly, I was kind of excited to go. I mean, not just because I was gonna be, like, feeling better afterwards, but because I'd heard such cool stories from people who'd been before. Like how they had to make fists in the sand, or move marbles with their feet, or stand on a platform while people threw medicine balls at you, and it just it sounded like games that you had to play that would, like, ultimately heal you, and it just, that, that sounded so cool to me. Like, why does some of that stuff work? In a way, I was jealous of those people, but, you know, you can't say that. You can't say you're jealous of someone because they're hurt, you know? They're going to physical therapy. They don't want to be going there, but I don't know, it sounded like fun. Like when you're a kid and you have to stay home from school, except you don't have to stay home, you get to stay home. It's an event, it's exciting, except you're sick. But you know what I mean, it's kind of like an opportunity. Like even as an adult, like the idea of being sick is almost exciting in a way because people will have to care about you and you won't be held responsible for anything and you don't have to do anything. You don't have to feel guilty about it. It's great, really, except that you're sick. Anyway though, Ben, I arrived at physical therapy on my first day and I immediately felt, well, foolish, quite frankly. All of a sudden, my injury seemed more like an injury compared to the other people there. Some of the people had broken bones or were learning how to walk or were missing limbs and I'm just standing there like, uh, my knee hurts. Did you make it better? But they walked me back and I was immediately reinvigorated, Ben, because if you haven't been to the physical therapist's office, it's kind of like a, a toy store. They got these giant bouncy balls all over the place and trampolines and jump ropes and these stretchy bands and monkey bars and it looks like you're gonna have a great time. But I didn't get to use any of those fun machines, Ben. Instead, what I did was stretch. So much stretching! A lot of this action right here. And so many lunges! Basically what I learned was that if I'd taken the proper precautionary methods, I could have avoided the injury entirely, and that the treatment for the injury was mostly the same precautionary measures, just on a much higher volume. So I have to spend like an hour a day stretching now. But it's okay, because I can run again. Yay. So Ben, my question for you and everybody else is, did you ever get excited about being sick at all? Am I weird like that? What did you do when you were home sick from school? Was it like fun or was it just miserable because you were sick? Also, we've had a few grizzly eagle shark submissions. Check these out. Oh, look, it's a baby grizzly eagle shark and an adult grizzly eagle shark. Oh my God, it looks awesome. Also, we got our first piece of P.O. Box mail today. Hey, it's Katie95 sent us this awesome picture of herself, which she was kind enough to autograph and wrote this really nice letter which is beyond nice and lastly Ben you may recall last week during Juxta Bros when we gave a shout out to our friend Ryder aka foot of a ferret and said I bet he takes off one day well less than a week later none other than Smosh retweeted one of his videos so just congratulations well done buddy that's it for me but I will see you in another life brother so many lunges Ugh. this is why they say stretch before you run Ben Back in high school, I was like, I don't even feel like this is doing anything, but now I see what it did. It stopped me from having to do this 40 times a day.